1967, I went to the Billy Graham Crusade here in Winnipeg. My parents took me to Sunday school and church, and so it, they had also take us to something like the Billy Graham Crusade. But I had decided I wanted to go forward. I wanted to be sure that I was going to go to heaven when I died. There are thousands of young people here tonight. I do remember going down, and I remember somebody meeting me who sat me down and went through everything with me, and she did a very good job. She didn't minimize the fact that I was a little girl. The Billy Graham Evangelistic Association is very good at giving out material, and this is the kind of thing that was given out. A little My Commitment folder. Well, here, I'm supposed to get up each morning, clean my fingernails, comb my hair. I'm supposed to obey my parents without talking back. I respect my teachers and also little Bible lessons. And I... And you still have it today. I still have it today. Right. I looked for them this morning because I thought, this is, this is archive material, right? <laughs> We've developed a prayer walk through this fork site. We start right over there. It's called the Orientation Node. And then we walk around behind the Children's Museum. Then we move on through the Prairie Garden. And then we make our way back here, right in front of the stage. Having seen video clips of previous Rock the River tours, I see that Franklin is very, very much like his dad. Straightforward to the point the gospel is the good news, and this is what we are sharing. It's the power of God through the gospel that brings people to Him. This Rock the River event is going to look a lot different than the event that I attended when I was a little girl. The music has changed. The things that will inspire a young person these days has changed. And so why would we not think that He can use the type of music that the kids are listening to.